Hey everybody, NecroVMX here, and uh, this is the Fargle Schnott video, which some of you are expecting, some of you not expecting. Um, basically, anybody who saw the Castlevania Circle of the Moon Part 4 video uh, from the day before yesterday, that would be, uh, see, I don't even know what fucking day it is, that would be Tuesday, um, you would be, uh, you know what I'm talking about, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, or if you haven't seen that video, shame on you. And, but don't worry, I will explain it. But before I explain it, I just wanted to say a little bit of what's going on here. Um, I know I didn't do any videos yesterday, and this is going to be the only video I put up today. And then I'm not going to be here uh, tomorrow or Saturday, so I won't be coming back till Sunday. And uh, so you guys are... I'm basically taking the rest of the week off from gameplay videos, so sorry to anybody who is looking forward to uh, more Circle of the Moon and... Um, Re, uh, request videos and to make up for that I'll even tell you what the next uh, few request videos I'll tell you what the next four request videos are I'm going to be doing Vigilante 8 on the N64 um, Rocky Rodent for Super NES Zero the Kamikwa uh, Kamikaze Squirrel for Super NES and Cutthroat Island for Super NES Ugh. that's probably Don't, none of those sound any good but especially that last one just let you know what's going on. Uh, it's no big deal. I, I just it's uh, been a very tiring week for me. And yesterday I was like I could do videos, but I think I'm gonna go lay down for a while. And I wound up taking this long ass nap. And you know, and I'm just I'm pretty tired today. It's just been a you know a, a long fatiguing week. So I just uh, I haven't taken a break from videos in a in a while. So I'm just gonna do that for a few days. So I'll see you guys again on Monday. Um, but I wanted to let you know about the Fargle Schnott thing now. During Castlevania Circle of the Moon Part 4, I randomly said the word Fargle Schnott, which is not a word. Um, it's spelled F-A-R-G-L-E-S-C-H-N-O-T-T, -T, or you could have just looked at the title of this video, so, <laughs> you know, I didn't really need to do that. But I said, you know, well, I, just, I guess I just made that word up, but it doesn't have a definition, so why don't you guys tell me what you think the definition is, and I'll pick the funniest one or the best one, and that'll be the official definition of Fargelschnot. And then I got to thinking, well, what if what if I didn't come up with that on my own? What if, like, there is a word out there called Fargelschnot? So this is actually pretty funny. Uh, yesterday I went on Google and I typed in Fargelschnot, and I got zero results. And you know how tough it is to type anything into Google and to get zero results, because the internet is as vast as my peen. Well, I checked it again today, and it, it only got two results, and both of them were uh, me. One was my channel, and the other was that specific video for Castlevania Circle of the Moon. So I guess it's official. Nobody else came up with Fargle Schnott. But I got a bunch of responses, and some of them are funny, some of them are not so funny, and a lot of them were gross. A lot of you guys seem to think that it had to be dirty or gross. It didn't have to be dirty or gross. But let's just go through them. Let's see. Uh, Whitebeard the King says, I believe that a Fargle Schnott is when you have shit in your mouth and you laugh so hard the shit comes out of your nose. I'm assuming that you uh, you don't literally mean shit that it could be anything that's I don't know I, there's probably a name for that though that, that particular thing so I'm gonna say that's not a Fargle schnot um, Anil Ladd says I believe a Fargle schnot is when you rub your nipples too hard with sandpaper covered in hydroglycerin why would you want to do that that's fucked up I don't think that's what a Fargle schnot is. That's not even funny. That just made me kind of wince. It made me kind of like, it made my nipples kind of hurt, you know. So, uh, Nightwing45304. Oh, no, he didn't He didn't do the Fargle schnot thing. I'm sorry. Uh, Twilight Prince 123 says, Fargle schnot, hmm. Sounds like a made-up word you'd say instead of an actual one as a kid so you don't get in trouble for cursing. Yeah, I don't think kids are going to come up with Fargle schnot. That's not very good. Let's move on. Uh, Mega Gray said, uh, as for Fargle Schnott, I guess it's when one of those goddamn automatic toilets goes off while you're still on it and putrid toilet water splashes up your ass crack. That, that's the first one that actually made me laugh. So that was pretty good for Mega Gray. Um, God Star Scream says, I believe a Fargle Schnott is when you spray someone's ball sack with schnots, then you put the balls in to mouth 
and clean it as you gargle. Be sure to swallow all the juices. Dude, that's fucking nasty. That's not even, like, funny. That's just... Like, you, you spraying your schnots on a dude's ball sack and then you gargle it off? It's like... I don't know, man. You know what, though? I, I don't think that's a Fargle schnot because I, there, there probably is a name for that. Um, Kamikaze Izaku says, I believe what a Fargle schnot is... That feeling when you you laugh so hard that you poop a little. <laughs> okay, all right. Okay, that that's acceptable. I like that one. Uh, Mr. Chunky Monkey says, "I believe that a fargle schnot is when you're hitting it from back and the girl farts and you laugh and schnot comes out of your nose. Hence, fart girl schnot." Well, it's not fart girl schnot. It's fargle schnot. But I kind of like your definition. Um, Fred Adia says, I think a fargle schnot is German for a wet fart. It makes a gargle sound and feels like schnot coming out of your ass. A lot of people seem to think it sounds German. I don't know. I think it sounds Yiddish, but that's me. Uh, 666 Gator Kyle 666 says, you know, it's bad enough you have 666 once. You had to have it twice. I believe a fargle schnot is the moment when you realize that your life has been wasted. You're having a midlife crisis while on the toilet, squeezing out a really painful turd. You know, one of those that feels like it's going to rip up in your ass. To use it in context, and he's the only one that did this. <coughs> Last night I was just taking a dump and I totally had a fargle schnot. Everything seems clear to me now. I like that one. I like. I don't know why everybody seems to think it has to do with, like, poop, but that that's pretty funny. Uh, let's see. X Hollowfield X says, I believe a fargle schnot is when the garbage men refuse to take your garbage away on garbage day and you set their truck ablaze and yell, fargle schnot, motherfucker. <laughs> I like that one quite a lot, actually. Um, I like that. Uh, I also like that you didn't feel that it had to be dirty, so that the extra points for that. Uh, Free Monk Three says he believes that Fargle Schnott is piss-flavored vodka. That doesn't sound very good. Ugh. Mm. Uh, Bob Eight says I believe a Fargle Schnott is the correct term for the mating ritual of the Who's of Whoville. <laughs> I think Dr. Seuss is rolling over in his grave. <laughs> the focus not it is. Oh, I think that's the best one so far. <laughs> Cause I can just imagine it's like it's like uh like Pon Far for the Who's. It's like they, they have a, a mate a big massive mating orgy once every seven years, like like Vulcans do, except they're Who's. And they're all like, Come, come, join the Fargoshnot. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. I think we have a winner, but let me just read the rest of these. There's only three more. Uh, Fargle Schnott is the sound you make when Melina is giving you a blowjob. That's Josie Greg. I think if Melina was giving you a blowjob, you'd be screaming your head off because she'd be ripping into your cock with her horrible Baraka teeth. So, I don't know. I really don't want the word, this wonderful word, to be connected to something horrible. So, I don't know. Uh, Angel Beeps, you, you didn't even listen to me. I said you have to say it, the word Fargelschnot. They said something similar to the act of munging. Like I said, I don't want it to be connected to something horrific, so we're just going to go past that. And finally, B-Boy187 Skills, Skills with a Z, got to love it, says it's German for fanny fart. Nah, dude, that's lame. Sorry. Uh, I think that i got to say that Bob Aid is the winner, so he gets 50% credit for inventing the word Fargelschnott. It is officially the definition of Fargelschnott is the correct term for the mating ritual of the Who's of Whoville. That's Horton, here's a Who having a Fargelschnott. <laughs> Good Lord. That is funny. So congratulations to Bob 8. Um, give yourself a nice hefty pat on the back. Thusly. And... Uh, you know, take a, take a day off from whatever you do and just reflect on the fact that you came up with the, the definition for a made-up word that some guy on the internet coined. Don't kill yourself, though. Seriously, I wasn't being sarcastic. It's, it's a good achievement. You know, achievement unlocked. Invented new word. All right, so I, I, I got to go. I'll see you guys on Monday. I uh, hope you had a, a good laugh at this video. Um... If you still have other things that you want to say what a Fargle Schnott is, feel free to say them, but it's just for fun. I just want to read what people think of when they hear the word Fargle Schnott. So, uh, but 
Um, the winner's Bob 8, though. That's definitely the funniest one. Um, so thanks to uh, everybody that contributed. See you Monday.